Hello, ocean explorers. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the mesmerizing world of jellyfish, one of the ocean's most beautiful yet mysterious creatures. From their graceful movements to their otherworldly appearance, jellyfish have been captivating the imaginations of scientists and ocean lovers alike for centuries. But did you know that some jellyfish grow to truly gigantic sizes? In this video, we'll explore the largest jellyfish in the world, uncover amazing facts about their unique biology, and reveal how these creatures have adapted to survive in some of the harshest environments on Earth. Stick around till the end to find out which jellyfish species holds the record for being the largest. Let's dive in! Dive. The lion's mane jellyfish is not only the largest jellyfish species, but one of the largest living creatures in the ocean. The largest recorded specimen had a bell or body diameter of over 7 feet, with tentacles that stretched an astonishing 120 feet, longer than a blue whale. Lion's mane jellyfish have an unmistakable appearance, with their reddish-brown jelly-like bodies resembling the mane of a lion. They have eight groups of tentacles, which contain thousands of fine, hair-like filaments used to catch prey. These giants are most commonly found in the cold waters of the North Atlantic and Arctic Oceans, but they can also be spotted in the Pacific. They prefer cooler environments, thriving in depths ranging from the surface to about 200 meters. Lion's mane jellyfish are carnivores, feeding on small fish, plankton, crustaceans, and even other jellyfish. They use their long, stinging tentacles to paralyze prey, which is then transported to their mouths. Coming in as another heavyweight of the jellyfish world is Nomura's jellyfish, native to the waters of Japan and China. These massive jellyfish can grow up to six and a half feet in diameter and weigh up to 450 pounds. Nomura's jellyfish have bell-shaped translucent bodies with long trailing tentacles that can deliver a painful sting. Nomura's jellyfish are known for their large swarms, or blooms, which can sometimes disrupt fishing operations by clogging fishing nets. Despite their impressive size, they move slowly and mostly rely on ocean currents to navigate the seas. They are not aggressive but can sting if touched, causing discomfort to humans. Now that we've met some of the ocean's largest jellyfish, let's explore more about their nature and how they live. Jellyfish are incredibly simple creatures in terms of biology. They have no brain, heart, or bones. Instead, they are composed mostly of water, up to 95%. Their bodies are made up of three main layers, the epidermis, which is the outer layer, mesoglea, a jelly-like substance in the middle, and the gastrodermis, the inner layer that aids in digestion. Jellyfish move by contracting and relaxing their bell, which propels them through the water in a pulsing motion. Despite this ability, most jellyfish rely heavily on ocean currents for long-distance travel, making them passive drifters in the sea. One of the most fascinating aspects of jellyfish is their nematocysts, or stinging cells, which they use to capture prey and defend themselves. These cells contain tiny, harpoon-like structures that release venom upon contact. While some jellyfish stings are harmless to humans, others, like the box jellyfish, can be extremely painful and even deadly. Let's dive into some mind-blowing facts about jellyfish that you may not know. Jellyfish are some of the oldest animals on Earth. They've been around for over 500 million years, making them older than dinosaurs. They've survived several mass extinction events, showcasing their incredible adaptability. Jellyfish don't have a brain. Instead, they have a basic nerve net that allows them to sense changes in their environment, such as light, temperature, and pressure, enabling them to react to stimuli without needing a centralized brain. Yes, you heard that right. The Turritopsis dorni, or immortal jellyfish, is capable of reversing its life cycle when injured or faced with starvation. It reverts back to its juvenile stage and can theoretically live forever, making it one of the most fascinating species in the ocean. In recent years, the number of jellyfish blooms, where large groups of jellyfish appear in one area, has increased. This is largely due to climate change, overfishing, and other human activities that have reduced the number of natural jellyfish predators like sea turtles. Despite their simple bodies and lack of a brain, jellyfish are incredibly adept survivors. Here's how. Jellyfish are found in every ocean, from the surface to the deep sea. Some species, like the lion's mane jellyfish, can tolerate cold Arctic waters, while others, like the moon jellyfish, thrive in warm tropical seas. 
Their stinging tentacles are their primary defense, allowing them to deter predators like sea turtles and large fish. Even when dead, jellyfish tentacles can still deliver a sting. Jellyfish have one of the most efficient swimming methods of any animal. By pulsing their bell-shaped bodies, they use very little energy to move, allowing them to survive in environments where food may be scarce. Most jellyfish have short lifespans, ranging from a few months to a year. However, the immortal jellyfish can reset its biological clock, giving it the potential to live indefinitely, making it a true wonder of the ocean. And there you have it. An incredible look into the world of jellyfish from the massive lion's mane jellyfish to the immortal wonders of the sea. These creatures may look delicate, but they are some of the ocean's oldest and most resilient survivors. Jellyfish continue to fascinate scientists and ocean lovers alike, and as we've seen today, they have so much more to offer than meets the eye. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and ring the notification bell for more amazing underwater content. Thanks for joining us on this jellyfish journey, and we'll see you in the next deep sea adventure.